Hi, and welcome to The Fit Nest. I'm Zara. Today we're gonna to be doing a complete core workout. You don't need much equipment. All you need is a mat and some sort of weighted ball or dumbbell. I've got an eight pound ball here. If you're a beginner, you can start with a three to five pound dumbbell. We're gonna go through one round on our own of six exercises, and then I'll get you to do the other three on your own. Okay, so the first exercise we're gonna do is a wood chop. You're standing with your feet a little wider than shoulder width apart. You've got the ball, you're gonna bring it to one side, and bend the knees, drop down, and come back up. So we're gonna go for 12. So we're gonna to stick to one side for one round, and then the second round, you're gonna to go to the other side. Two, up, three. Make sure to keep your knees wide. We're working and warming up that core. Five, good. Breathing through it. Six, seven, eight. Okay, we're gonna drop down the ball or your weight. The next exercise is called a transformer plank. So we're going into a plank. We're on our elbows. Make sure your elbows and shoulders are in line. Coming into a nice straight line. You're gonna come up onto your hands and then you're gonna come back down. We're gonna go for 12 rounds. Ready? Up, up, down, down. Up, down, down. We're coming up to three. This is working the shoulders. And as you keep your body straight, you're gonna feel that core kicking in. Good, we got five more to go. Five, up, four, three, two, last one, and one. Awesome, good. Coming down, we're gonna flip over into a V. So I'm gonna show you a modified version. You're gonna lie back, your hands are up above your head, your legs are out, you're gonna bring your upper body and your knees up, and then extend back down. So we're gonna go for 12. Up one, two, so make sure you're bringing the shoulders up, three, reach up, four, five, good. Breathing through it, four, three, pull your belly button in, two, and one. Perfect, now we're flipping over into a plank again. So we're gonna go on our elbows. Our body's gonna be nice and straight. You're gonna take one leg up and cross it over, and you're gonna come back out. In and out, ready, let's go. One, two, keep your hips down, Four, five, six, seven, eight, four more. Make sure you're not creeping back. Your face stays over your hands. One and two. Beautiful. Good. Okay. So the next exercise we're going to do is a crunch with alternating legs. So similar to the V sit, but now we're going to take opposite arm, opposite leg, reach up and down. So we're going to go 12 on one leg. Ready? Let's go. One. Up, two, three, four. We're going, five, really reach. Six, seven, eight, come on, let's do it. Four more. Three, two, and one, you got this. All right, last exercise, side plank. I'm gonna show you some options. Similar to the plank, we've got our elbow and shoulder in line. If you're a beginner, have your knees tucked back, your body nice and straight from the knees to the shoulders. You're gonna lift the hips up and come back down. If you feel like you can go a little bit more, straighten out the legs, come up and back down. So we're gonna go for 12, ready? Lift those hips up, one, up, two, three, reach up, four, five, if you're shaking, you're working, that's good. We're halfway, let's go for six more. Lift, six, lift all through here. Five, up, four, three, two, and one. And that is one round done, there you have it. Do three more on your own, the ones that you're doing one side, 
Make sure you switch to the other side and let me know how you do. Comment down below.